Hey everybody, uh, this is Rob at VFX Foam. Wanted to show you guys um, some theming we're doing on uh, some columns for an Egyptian themed escape room, escape adventure room attraction we're building exclusively for Family Entertainment Group. So this shows uh, the column after it comes off of the mill. So you can see the detail that's engraved in there using a mill, the mill. And then what the guys are going to do after this is go through, sand it, make sure that the column has a weathered look to it. But you can kind of get an idea of some of the detail of work that goes into making these columns. What I'm going to show you guys next is uh, one of these columns actually being milled on our mill. So you can see here the mill going through this column slowly uh, drilling out each of the little fine details or engravings that we put into these columns. This is the spindle that slowly rotates this column. So each pass, it'll turn it slightly and then start milling out the next piece. makes it kind of smooth. The guys will go in and give it that weathered look as well. So here we'll show you how this rotates after the pass comes all the way back here. Then what I'll do is I'll go back, I'll show you guys um, one of the columns after it's taken off of the mill. So again, you can see what this will look like once this machining has been completed. And we're about to rotate, and it just rotated slightly. Not sure if you caught that. So you can see these jobs take hours to go through, and after that, a lot of time sanding, sculpting, and getting it to look like this. Here I'll actually show you guys uh, Langley working on uh, some of the pieces that we're doing for this Egyptian themed escape room, escape adventure room attraction. So here you can see after it's been taken off of the mill and the hot wire cutter, the guys will go through, hand sand it and sculpt it, and this gives it the final form that we're looking for and for the customer specs on these props. Here's another element that we're building for this attraction. closer so you can see a little bit more of the detail. So all this uh, weathering, the cracks that you're seeing, all that is hand sculpted by our prop masters and to give it that, that final cracked look. So that's what that piece looks like. I'll show you one of the gods that we're doing. So this guy will be part of one of the puzzles along with several other guys that we have in another room. And uh, I'll actually take you back there so you can check that stuff out as well. 
Uh, these things remind me of the Triforce out of Zelda, I don't ask. Um, anyways, these are part of another puzzle that we're doing. So these pieces here aren't part of it, these are just some separate elements, but underneath you can see these triangle shaped props that will actually be part of that puzzle piece. If you look closely, you can see some of the weathering that the guys have added by hand. Some of the trim molding they did for it. Awesome work, these guys. All right, let's show you guys some more panels here. Here's another one of the theme panels that'll go part go to this attraction. So again, that cracked, weathered look. Uh, this is all done by hand. The engravings that you're seeing and the uh, the relief cut, that's all done by our mill. This is going to be a stone slab door to one of the rooms. And this will be opened by an actual actuator as well as some Arduino coating. Um, let's go into the back here, show you guys. Um, I don't know if you remember these guys. We have some uh, Anubis. And let's see here. So these are headers, or what we call soffit pieces. These go at the top of each of the rooms and help to theme the ceiling part. Also in behind the back here, it's all routed out for electronics. So wires, um, anything that we need to run hardwired would go back behind these panels and through those. Um, these will all be coated with a fire rated coating as well. So here's some more of the pieces. So these are conformed to uh, building codes and all that good stuff. I'm gonna show you some more of the gods. And we'll show some of that detailed work that the client was looking for as far as distressing and some of that weathered look and cracked look. And basically these guys are gonna have a pedestal under the hands and on top of the pedestal is going to sit a puzzle piece that uh, once it's solved is going to allow the people out of the room. Show another one of the gods. So this is a different version Sorry about that, out of focus a little bit. But again, seeing the cracks, the, sh the distress work, the weathering. And last but not least, we have one more here. And this is a another version. And here's a picture of a, uh, a dial this is another one of the pieces that go to a puzzle in one of the rooms. All right, guys. Well, that's it for today. Uh, stay tuned. We'll have some more videos and updates for you guys later on. Thanks for tuning in, and uh, have a great day.